Hey everyone, see what Bowtie here with another episode of Trauma Team with special guest Caleb and Taylor. And we're about to do another diagnostics on this guy, this poor soldier boy. Old Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are falling. <laughs> now, just as I thought, we found a tumor in your lungs. Something odd's been found too. I'm sorry, but I'll, I'll need to look into it more. Um. Huh? What's wrong? Are, are you in pain? I have a daughter. Oh. Uh, she'll be turning three this summer. Oh no. I see. Well, all the more reason to hurry your exams along. Wouldn't want to miss your daughter's birthday and have her run off with some boy, right? <laughs> of course not, sir. Alright, so, questions? Oh, yeah. As of a moment ago, my stomach has begun to hurt. Abdominal pains now. The conditions of this disease may be progressing after all. Roni, record that. Doctor, new symptom. Yeah, we already know. Sorry. Th that's all. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Can you look at his eyes again because they're yep. red? Or they're darker. Hmm. The whites of his eyes have become yellow. It's jaundice. Browning, you know what to do. Understood, doctor. New symptom observed. Jaundice. Okay, we need to skip the scope. Let's look at those abs again. I think there's gonna be something wrong with this coming noises. Yeah. Because he said don't change. But I'm just checking. Okay. Wow, not that. Probably later it'll come up somehow. Alright, so the next one is diagnostic. Just all the cells, so here we go. Um, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Fine, 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 not fine. Here we go. Which is a uh, ooh ooh the one below it. His total bilirubin level is way above average. Roni, and the one below that. that. Ast alt. Yeah. Did he say add that to the shopping list? Yes. Unless I'm saying yes for no reason. His ast level is unusually high. Abnormally high, I would say. New symptom observed. High ast level. You really should have invited your sister on here so she could be like, oh yeah, I know what that means. Like, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, because um, Caleb's sister is taking up nursing. So. It's fun. That's not normal. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, yeah. It, it would have been a good, it would have been kind of fun. Like maybe like a, a couple of episodes, not like a whole part of the series, the rest of the series. Uh, wow, uh, Whoa. YGT. Yeah. And I think the one below it. Yep. His gamma GTP is abnormally high. Gamma G Gamma. 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 Oh, I see it now. Yeah, 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 yeah. And there's a lap. The one below it's fine. L is P level is definitely beyond the average range. I mean he does not look like he skips leg day, so his his lap is fine. Texas <laughs> LAP levels. Uh, Whoa. Wait, 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 Whoa. wait, wait. AFP is high, so it's. The PIVCA 2 level's too high. Roni? I'm sorry, but the AFP high that's is supposed the, to be that's 10. That's the biggest differential I've ever seen. Yeah, nah, I'm joking. Yeah, that's kind of. Mm. There's an abnormality in the AFP level. You think? Roni, record this. New symptom observed. The next few look like they're good. Mm -hmm. Or okay, so we're good. 
Well, we've got some more things to consider. Let's sort them back out at our workspace. So, out we go. <clears throat> now, let's see if we can't narrow things down a bit with this new data. Alright, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, oh gosh. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so I'm gonna be a chronic, um, malignant liver tumor. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Might as well check. Um, so let's go on down first and just work our way up. Um, so uh, in the liver. So that's the CT scan. So we can't do that yet. Okay. There we go. Um, a high gamma level. Oh, no. Uh, Black. LAP. ALT. AST. AFP. And the. And the high total. Jonas. All of them are on there. Don't we get it? Is it all on there? Yeah, I saw the other one. Wow. Malignant liver tumor? I can't believe we have to. I got to choose the right one first. It's not fully confirmed. I have a bad feeling. We gotta get. Would you like to send in yes. a request for a Yeah. Get me a CT scintigraphy. Okay. I want to check the CT first. Understood, Doctor. So we need to look for the abdominal and we need to CT examination is now available. And I please check the CT yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll head to the... All right, so we're going to look for a swollen and then the second one we'll be looking for an abnormal accumulation. All right, cool. So let's do it. Uh, don't talk. That's it. Like, I don't remember us having to say or talk. I mean, it makes sense if, like, you played this for a long time. You have no clue where you're done. Yeah, and so. The CT scans are just ready. say where you are. Yeah, let's get to it. We're actually doing pretty well. For this one, yeah. Oh, oh god. Yes. You had to say something. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Alright. Okay. Right now, I'm gonna see if anything straight up pops first. Which that one? Yes. Where? Oh, um, we're gonna have to get up and show. Right here. Oh yeah, there's a big break. Good eye. Just yep. Swollen. swollen. Roni, record this. My my key brain as a child must have been terrible because I remember spending hours on this every gameplay I did. I mean, at the same time I'm playing with you guys, so I mean, uh, probably the same thing. Yeah. Yeah, but it's probably gonna come back saying that's yeah. See, so I'm looking for something else. Well, it's not gonna be in this. It's gonna be in the other exam. Yeah. Okay. Oh boy. It's all shifting, but not too much shifting. I'm looking for like cloudiness anywhere, which I know is hard for you, Caleb. Ooh, wait. Ah, right there. Tell me if that's right, Caleb. See that? Yeah, it is. This light shadowing. Is this yes. Roni, collate it with your data. Check if Can you even see that, Caleb? Hmm? Can you even see that? No. no. Okay. Probability of relevant correspondence is. 58%. Very low, but still. Since it isn't a clear shadow, it's impossible to collate it further. No, it's still. Mm, too close to make a call. I'll need to double check this with the scintigraphy after all. Roni, bring up the scintigraphy results. Are they ready? Yes, Doctor. The scintigraphy is now available. Awesome. All right. All right. And this one is. Ooh. I'm already telling you. Guys. Is it just me, or does it look like a hand's grabbing it? I don't know. Like, y'all see it too, yeah, right? Yeah, it, it looks like a beast inside is grabbing his liver. The accumulation can be seen in this tumor in the liver, but this shape isn't normal. Doctor, this shadowing is similar in shape to that of the one confirmed in the lungs. Yeah, but it isn't normal. Roni, make a note in his file. Understood, Doctor. New... Start running. I'm slow for me right now. Right. So okay. So going back. Yes. Yeah. Got more. Understood. Yeah. Sorry. I'm, I'm kind of 
skipping over and simply saying some stuff. So, all right. Uh, I'm just gonna. All right. You okay there? There's almost no mistake. It's malignant liver tumor. Part three. But what is that? Sh First, it's in the lungs. And now, it's in the liver. What in the world's going on? Oh yeah, Roni. Send a progress report to the higher ups. Our client's probably starting to get impatient. Yes, doctor. Would you like to continue on with the diagnosis? Yeah. There's still something that doesn't add up. I have a bad feeling about this. Understood, doc. Doctor, we have an urgent situation. I received a report that the patient collapsed. Please head to the examination room immediately. What? I'm on my way. All right, let's get to it. Shadowing in the liver, too? What the hell's going on? The patient's condition has worsened. Please go to the exam room. <laughs> Damn it. I'm gonna find out what it is no matter what. Start. Is he on the floor or on the bed? Pretty sure he's on the bed, but it's like... Oh, doctor. You don't look well. I heard you collapsed. Are you alright? His eyes. Lost my balance. I'm sorry, sir. No, don't no, like me. It's fine, but don't strain yourself. If you don't feel well, my lost you balance for this else is going on. Doctor? Huh? What is it? I'm afraid of death. The fact that I might die from this it frightens me quite a lot, sir. I'm a failure as a soldier. It's okay to be afraid. Of course you're afraid, you dimwit. Huh? Everyone feels that way. After all, when you die, that's it. Doctors, soldiers, everyone's afraid of dying. Now, if you understand, then turn around and look at me. Let's run some more tests. I mean, I would expect you to be facing me right now. <laughs> Alright, so... Okay, fine. Listen to what he says first. Alright, cool. Doctor, I'm sorry. Oh, I this. can't cooperate with the examination any longer. <gasps> What do you mean? I was just given an order to cease all my cooperation with your diagnostics. What? That's impossible. What are you talking about? He is correct, Doctor. I have just confirmed that order. Our clearance for using the image analysis lab has been revoked as well. Pending further discussion, the Army will not let us diagnose him any further. Well, screw that! Who gives a damn about their politics? His condition is getting worse. Are they gonna just let him die? I cannot say, Doctor. However, given recent actions, that appears to be their intent. What? Doctor, it's all right. Uh. If you start making a scene, you won't be safe either. But you really tried your best to help me. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Damn it! That's not okay. It's not. Some Especially after he was like, I'm afraid of death. And he has a third. Yes, not, Doctor. Three year old, yeah. I have confirmed the existence of a spyware program installed on my hard drive. <gasps> if we examine the patient further, the army's leaders will be alerted. Okay. Don't use technology. Go by head. I have finished analyzing the spyware program. Huh? You can do that? I cannot delete it, but I have an understanding of its parameters. The program triggers an alarm whenever it registers direct diagnostic activity. <laughs> Alright, what are you getting at? It appears that if we make idle conversation with our friend, they will not be alerted. Roni, <laughs> you're so smart. I see where you're going. Great job, Roni. Whoever put that spyware together sure did a great job. D doctor what are you going to- Hmm? Oh, nothing. By the way, soldier, we're friends. Right? Uh huh? I if you say so, Doctor. Is that so? Then, let's have a friendly chat, shall we? Uh, I love that he's sad behind you. The fat. It's not like I'm examining you or anything, right? Ah, uh, yes, so, I mean, uh, bud? <laughs> uh, question time. Now then, I'm going to initiate a fun little chat with my friend here. And of course, it's just idle banter. That means oh, sorry. to make sure to pay attention to everything that comes out of his mouth. Doc, I mean, 
Mr. Cunningham, thanks for coming to chat with me. Let's see, uh, why don't I tell you about my life in the army? We soldiers go through severe conditioning training every day. Because of that, even sitting still like this, sometimes my muscles hurt. Muscle pains, huh? You don't say. Hey, Roni, can you jot that down? It's not important. Just a memo so I remember my friend later. Meaningless friendly observation. Roni, you're the best. You're the best, Roni. Still, in, in order to get promoted, you have to study, too. I try to make time at night to read the instructional materials, but just reading all that stuff gives me a headache sometimes, you know? I love his, like, coded. Ah, your head hurts, you say. Gee, I almost missed that one, clever friend of mine. Brody, would you be a dear and make a memo of that? I'd like to include it in my Christmas card this year. Okay, oh, more the headache. shade! The shade! <laughs> Observation. <laughs> you mean friendly observation? I love You didn't this. see that the first time? About, I no, I did. It's I forgot how exactly they said this. Oh, I just remember so this being open. annoying. The meals are usually pretty good, but sometimes I feel like uh, there isn't the hey, right on. balance of ingredients in the food. Huh. Do you think the ventilation's working? I, I think he's talking about spices. No, I just spice. have bow bow. Or some thing. Right balance, huh? Somehow, um, meant the food. It wobbliness, which is the reason why he fell over. That's still, he is my pal and all. I should make sure he's eating right. Army food's famously terrible. Roni, could you make a memo? Sure would suck if he got anemic from what they're feeding him here. That's <laughs> awfully sociable with you. Meaningless, friendly observation. That's awfully sociable with you. I was okay until a moment ago, but it suddenly feels really hot. Huh. Mister, you've been a good friend. You did really a good hot, but the AC's working just fine. Perhaps my acquaintance is stricken with a fever. Wait a minute. Maybe I can make use of this. I'm sorry, old chum, but you aren't able to cooperate with any exams, right? Uh, yes, I'm sorry. So, you can't lift up your shirt and let me examine you, right? Oh. Uh, as friends? No, I couldn't do that. Well, that's too bad. But orders are orders. Nevertheless, buddy, if you feel hot in here, feel free to take your shirt off and pull it down. Oh my god. <laughs> it's just us guys you in here, right? The bros. Just a couple of buds. Yeah, y'all were the ones talking about after earlier. Y'all might need to watch. But you're like, oh, full free show now. There you go again. Always trying to drive a stake between us. You're jealous of what we have. <laughs> well, that's one way to do it. Well, it is pretty hot in here. Maybe I will take my shirt off. Well, go right ahead. No sense being uncomfortable when we're having such a pleasant conversation. Would you like me to make a fever memo in case you wish to review this repartee at a later date? <laughs> Why, yes, that would be splendid. When this is taking forever, but I think I've told this interaction. Good acquaintance here. Naturally, Doctor. It is in my programming to have a pleasant bedside memo. <laughs> That's awesome. That is freaking awesome. So. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, I love you, man. Pigment spots. That's not a good color. Roni, this is very rare. Bravo to my friend here for displaying such exquisite coloring. on its rareness. I think I'm it too. <laughs> right back. His eyes. Can you look at his eyes again? I think that's the last thing I know. Hmm. Let's shut eyes. I hate it when my 
friends have these troubles. Crony, can you jot that down? Pile it in one of those uh, useless non-medical databases. <laughs> uh, it's kind of going too far now, but that's enough. Oh. All right. We've gotten all the. Si I mean. Man, oh man, that was a riveting discussion. Crony, I think my old pal needs his rest. Perhaps we should return to our workspace and rest as well? I agree, Doctor. Alright, here we go. Okay, we have one, two, three, four. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, oh, so five, six. So we have six already. So based on the name, the acute. Okay, so that means ble blood having something to do with the blood conjunction. No, up, up, up. Uh, I, I know. I'm just like putting it down here for right now. So you think this one possibly with that many? Yeah. Okay. Right, let's see. Eye symptoms include mucus in the eye, bloodshot eyes. Feeling the foreign bone touching the eye, swollen eyelids. Oh, do we still have that? Nope. Um, hemorrhaging. Um, and since we see the heat and light. Um, Headache. Fever. Yep. Um, limbs. No. At least it's not include the uh, ears. So I gotta check his ear later. Um, I don't so, think it's that. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna. Try one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'm gonna try this. Sore is great. <laughs> Fever, headache. Huh, that looks pain. so familiar right now, especially in the news. <laughs> um, okay, so. Fever. Fever, headache. Um, muscle, muscle pain. pain. No coughing yet. Um, ah, this is seriously not. I don't think it's it either. Dang it. Okay, so that's good. No, it's not. Um, Fever. Yeah. Joint pains, headaches. Headaches. Yeah. Okay. Lost appetite, not picking up. Um, Other cough, symptoms include. Um, blood stool and pigment spots. Um, call up. Okay. That seems familiar, just saying. Um, heart rate, don't have, can't get any of that right now. Nope. No, I don't think this is it. This uh, is not it. Yeah, this okay. is not it. Right. What the world? Uh, this one's horrible without everything else. Um, gosh. Try oh, that one. This one? No, it's not going to One, two, that. three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Yeah. The malaria? Really? Fever. Fever. Bloodshot eyes. Headache. Headache. Muscle pain. Um, what is anemia? Yeah, I forget what. Anemic. Oh, yep. Yeah. And then pigment spots. Is there anywhere? Pigment. Scroll down. Uh, so we show the whole thing. Little so platelet like count. May also become anemic if it sees this progressed. Okay, back up. Oh. So not this one also? No. Back up. Okay, so which one? Okay, this is you, the only one. You at least have to show up. Fever. Damn it. I had a feeling we didn't have enough information. Okay. More if I'm going to narrow down the disease. Rome, so really, I could have just done one of each and be like, oh. No, we would have to put all of them. The patient. The army's leader seemed to be making a move. Please be careful. Okay, so fix it out. Exactly. Yeah, honestly, because I can't go in there. Okay, what's up? Alright, uh, here we go. Here we go, cough. Hey, what's the matter? Stay with me! Uh, but I... it's suddenly... Uh, I need to examine you immediately. Just hang in there. Breathe. Yeah. Blood stains near the mouth.
out. Is this him coughing up blood? Rony, there's signs of hematemesis. Make a memo immediately. Do you guys see any shakiness? I'm not positive it'll show up. Check his question. Yeah. I don't think anything's in. He can't. If he goes. Yep, there we go. What? Hemorrhaging from the pigment spots. Rony, this isn't good. This. What the? Patient's vitals are dropping. He is in a dangerous state. He's coughing up blood. I'm halting the diagnosis. Roni, open up this section's door. Hurry and get someone. My access is denied. Oh my god. What? I don't care how you do it, just get this door open immediately. Uh, doctor. Huh? What is it? What's the matter? Please, keep learning what you can. Oh, you idiot. First aid is more important than that, right? I know. I'm not gonna make it. What are you saying? You're gonna see your daughter. Then hang in there. I'll get you treated. <laughs> They won't open the door until you're done here. You've got to know that by now. Whatever I've got is already spreading to the outside world. They they knew all along. <laughs> if that's the case, then that bruise was. Uh, if you find out what this is right now, it won't be just me or my family. Families everywhere will suffer. Please, find out as much as you can while I can still help you. Damn it. All right. I'll unmask whatever you have right now. Hell, I'm sure that they'll even open the doors when I finish diagnosing you. Just don't die until then. Don't you dare. Roni, I'm proceeding with the diagnosis. What next? Since the circuits were cut off, I've regained a portion of the controls. Ooh. Because the patient is vomiting blood, an analysis exam is possible if you take a sample of his blood. All right. Get it analyzed right now. Understood, Doctor. The analysis exam is now available. All right. And I'm going to pause it here, and um, we'll continue in the next episode. How's that sound? Oh, he right. lives that long. Oh, right. he's going to. Don't worry. I know. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you guys then. See ya. Bye. Adios.